Removal of natural buffers between land and sea, such as mangroves, allows the products of terrestrial erosion to wash straight into marine habitats. The coral animal is able to tolerate acute episodes of sedimentation by secreting mucus as a defense mechanism, helping to keep their surfaces clean. Nonetheless, destructive activity on land allows a continual input of sedimentation. This form of pollution, in particular the fine silt fraction of the sediment, directly smothers coral reefs, blocking out the sunlight required for photosynthesis. The short-term effect can interfere with corals by lowering growth rates, metabolism, and fecundity. Prolonged smothering and burial eventually causes the coral to die. In addition, the silt covers the hard substrate that was available for settlement of juvenile corals, making recruitment of the propagules impossible and reducing the reproductive success.